What's up guys, Acid Explosion here, and welcome back to Minecraft X-Ray Survival. Today we are going to go ahead and explore the second part of that cave that we found. Um, or, or basically like, second cave, I guess you could say. Um, but first I want to show you, I added the second store to the house. So like I said, we're going to just continue to build up and up and up, and it's going to get smaller each time. Because as you see, this is against the wall. And this is not against the wall. So it's exactly, it's one block smaller all the way around. Now let's see if I can call this backwards. And you can just, you can clearly tell it gets smaller when you go up. Um, but I think, still yet, it'll be really cool. So this might be the last floor up here. Um, I guess, depending on how large it is. Or we might have one more after. Because inside it would be, no, because this inside would be a 3 by like 4. So, I think we might just have three stories on this. Ouch. Keep forgetting there's no ladder there. Um, I mean, I didn't forget. I just don't think I'll take fall damage. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That was a big lag spike. I don't know if you guys saw that or not, or if it was worse in the video. But, anyhow, we've got 32 iron still. So, let's say we make some armor. Uh, let's not do that just yet, though. I did go ahead and make another pickaxe. I also made another axe. Um, let's just go ahead and rearrange this whole thing. Uh, ooh, food. I need food, too. Yummy pork chops. Alright, so now we're on full health. So, let's say we go ahead and go down there and explore that second cave. Um, let's go check out... Let's go check on our zombies. See how they're doing. Generally, I feel like they don't really spawn... Um, as frequently, unless if, uh, if you were to come over here. Come on. Yeah, well, whatever. We don't really need to worry about them. We're just gonna go ahead and down this way. Go ahead and head down this way. You know what? I feel like it's really lagging right now. Um, but my FPS is... Is, like, 33. Wait a minute. No, that's horrible. It's, like... Yeah, I think it might be lagging, like, a lot. Um, I will be right back. Okay, guys, I am back, um, and I looked at the footage, and it didn't really seem that it was that laggy, that bad, but I did go ahead and restart the game. Um, also, I did restart the screen recorder, so uh, the FPS does not seem to be too much higher, but, you know, I guess you just have to live with it. It, it does run... You know, my computer is weird, because it doesn't run any higher than, um, 60 FPS, and when it's recording, it seems like it runs at, like, 40, 45, and I hate creepers. Get away. Please don't just blow up for no reason. Get out of here. Are you serious? I was... <sighs> I backed up enough. Come on. Okay, well, you know, I just realized I forgot to bring torches. Um, so, yeah, I guess I gotta go get those. Um, right now I have basically no idea how long I've been recording. Probably, I'd say about, uh, three minutes. Because when I cut the first one, it was like two minutes long. Um, eh, yeah, so, you know, it, it feels better. It doesn't feel as choppy as it did. Um, and the footage did not look choppy to me at all. So, you know. Looks like I only have four torches anyhow. Uh, how about I make some more with that coal and these four sticks. Hey, it's perfect. I grabbed four coal and I got four sticks. So, there we go. So, there we go. Now we have 20 torches, which I think should be perfect. Uh, let's go ahead and head back down this mine. Finally. Sorry, guys. That was a little delay. It just felt, it just felt kind of choppy. But I guess maybe that's the way it's always been. Oh, you know what? Since let's make up for it. Let's kill some. Oh gosh, dang it! Gosh, dang it! I, uh... In hindsight, you know what? I'm just gonna fly because this is annoying, having to come in and out so much. <clears throat> I probably should have seen that coming, honestly. Uh, the fact that I, the fact that the sword was on very low durability, should have tipped me off. But you know, I wasn't paying attention to that so yeah all right now we can finally get out of here i'm gonna fly once again because 
it just is gonna take forever if I don't. Alright. So now we kill some zombies. And then we head into the mine. How's that sound? Okay. Sounds good. We kill those guys. And we head into the mine. Finally. It just felt really choppy, and I don't think it feels as choppy anymore. Dang it, he still got a hit on me. That sucks. Alright, well, at least I brought my torches now. So let's drop that there. And hey, there's some iron right here in the wall, which is nice. Let's go ahead and drop another torch up here. Uh, yeah. So hopefully this cave is more promising than the last one. Uh, you know, because the last one didn't really lead us much. So I ended up mining through it to get to another cave that I found using the cave finder. So. Eh, yeah, that's pretty much all the iron in that section. Um, <clears throat> let's see. There's some more iron right here, which is nice. Looks like there might be eight pieces. Because there's three, four, yeah, there's eight pieces here. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right. Ten. Eleven. Okay, well, I guess there's eleven pieces of iron. Um, twelve pieces of iron. Okay, never mind. Uh, this equals, like, fifteen pieces of iron. That's actually a very big, um, very big number. Sixteen. And that's it. That's everything. I can pretty much guarantee that. Alright, let's go ahead and get out of here. I pressed the wrong button. And let's continue on. Whoops. I must have pressed C by accident. So, again... Dude, this cave has a lot of iron so far, so that that's a good sign. Um, although I would like to find a cave that goes very deep, and again, if this cave leads to nowhere, although there is water, so that kind of seems like a good sign. Um, again, if this cave does end up leading to nowhere, there's a skeleton and zombie over there as well. Shoot, I feel like he's going to shoot me. I think he's going to try to. Oh, yep, he's going to try to shoot me. Oh, gosh, he shot me. Charge! I hate skeletons. You, they're they're the worst. Like not pretty pretty much nothing else in this game is bad, except for maybe ghasts. Um, but everything else you can deal with. So looks like this cave does split off, which again is a good sign. It goes down that way, and it also comes down this way. And there's some iron under this water as well. And since it's going to gonna annoy me a bunch, I'll keep it there just in case I might need the source block later or something. But for now, I'm gonna just block it off. So that I can get through here and mine out this iron with no problem. And it looks like there's some right here as well. Or maybe I was a block off. Yeah, it was. Well, whatever. Either way, as long as we get the iron, that is perfectly okay. Uh, yeah. So. I don't hear any more mobs, really. Uh, which is good. Although I'm sure there are some more further down in the cave. Uh, let's see. How about we head this way first? It seems more promising, just because, I don't know, it goes down. Oh, maybe it's not more promising. Dang. Actually, wait a minute, it does continue. There's just a bunch of gravel in the way. Alright, thank you, Cave Finder, for that. Okay, well, I was trying to place a torch there, but it didn't really work out. Dang, I wish I had a shovel right now. Alright, I like this. The cave actually does continue, so that's cool. I thought, dang it, it's another dead end. Because whenever I find caves, they're always a dead end. Wait, was this open the whole time and I could have just walked around? Wow, okay. That was a waste of time. <laughs> Do I need this coal? Not sure, not yet, at least. Um, I'm not going to take the time to mine it. Unless I really desperately need it. Okay, never mind, it is a dead end. Uh, well. I tell you, every single cave I find is a dead end. Except when I find an abandoned mine chest, then it's not a dead end, and it's very fun to explore. Because there's minecart with chest, and you can find some cool stuff in there. I believe I found melon seeds from there, too. So if we do ever want to make a melon farm, and because I do, because melon is awesome. Melon is, like, the best. It seriously is. I mean, if you're just, like, two, two health bars low, like I am right now, why would I eat a pork chop that heals four health bars? I mean, I guess... I have to because I'm dropping quite a few hearts, but 
I mean, I like melons because they only cure one health bar. So you can basically, um, hunger bar, sorry. So you can basically just eat, eat them all the time, which is why I absolutely love it. Uh, so it looks like we've got about five minutes left in the video. And so I'm going to go ahead back this way and hope that this way is not a dead end. If it is, then screw it. We're going to have to find another cave yet again. Oh, oh gosh, that scared me for a second. Hi, Bat, how you doing? If bats were harmful, that would suck, because it's hard to hit them a lot of a lot of the times. Hey, there's some more water over here, too. Wait, I thought I heard something. I need to drop another torch up here as soon as I can get across this water. Aha, there we go. What up, bats? You guys having a fun day? I think you are. I'll just use that gravel since it's basically useless, unless to make flint steel, of course. Okay, um, yeah, you know what, I'll get this iron, because why not? Even though it is a little bit under, I guess it doesn't really matter. Because it's not that far under, so I'll just dig down a few blocks and find some more iron. So, this has been sort of a successful day so far, I haven't found anything but iron, which I guess is okay, because we're only in our, what, fifth? Fourth episode, I believe? Either fifth or fourth, and there's some more right here, so I would have missed all of that. Um, thank you, X-ray mod. Uh, so anyway, I guess you know what? On the next episode, I don't know if we'll continue to mine. I might continue to mine on my own, uh, depending on what you guys would think. Maybe the next episode I'll continue to mine, but then the episode after that, eventually I'll get a farm going and have all everything all fine and dandy. Uh, wow, see, there's, there's, I tell you, there's basically iron everywhere we look, everywhere you look. <clears throat> so, the harder things to find are things like gold, and redstone's also very easy to find. Um, speaking of redstone, there's also a little, there's also a button, specifically to find, if you press R, shows literally all the redstone in the ground. I wish there was, I wish, like, you press, a. Uh, Another button like T, and you it just highlights all the diamonds. That would be pretty sick, actually. <laughs> so yeah, we basically are probably never gonna run out of redstone, which is good because I like redstone. Um, I can make awesome contraptions with it. Oh, thank goodness this is not a dead end. I was kind of thinking it was gonna be, cause you know how, like I said, I always find caves with dead ends. So that that really sucks. Um, okay. So we're just going to go ahead and mine out this iron real fast, and then I guess we will continue on, not entirely sure. Um, fly mod's very helpful. Fly mod, no, 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 no! Are you absolutely serious? Another dead end? Shoot. Alright, is there anything this way? That's the cave I've already been at. This way? Okay, so I, I see a ravine over there. I don't know how far away it is. I don't know if it's good or if it's not good at all. Ooh, 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 where is that? Dude, I want to get there right now. You know what, let's move over there, and I'm going to break this block so I can see it a bit better. Dude, that's a lot of lava. <laughs> it's flowing down like the entire cave, which is awesome. Uh, there's also a lava pool over there. Then again, you know what, I'm probably just going to have to mine straight down into a very deep mine in order to, you know, find something good. But, you know, if it's the cost, that's what it is. So, I guess since this is another dead-end cave, this is basic this is where I'm going to end the episode off. Um, uh, guys, on the next episode, I will probably look for another cave. Or maybe in my in my own time, I'll look for another cave, and I'll let you guys know if I find anything. And I'll start recording from there, and and I'll make sure it's a good cave. I will definitely make sure that's a good cave. So if you look straight down, basically what I'll do is I'll find a cave, I'll mine straight down, right into it. Uh, well, not technically straight down, but just straight down so that I can build steps up, because that is good. It still feels choppy. Why is it choppy? Well, you know what, I, just, I have to work with that issue. Um, I don't know if it's bad in the video, but it's pretty bad for me so 
Anyway, guys, uh, thank you for watching this episode of Minecraft X-Ray Survival. If you did enjoy, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. I would really appreciate it. Um, if you would like to see the next episode, then stay tuned till tomorrow when I upload the next video. The next episode. And, yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um, stay cool. Maybe that's something I should say. Maybe I should say that at the end of my videos. Stay cool. Peace out, guys.